back, everybody, to the Orlando Huskies franchise. It is week three of season six, and the 2-0 Huskies are taking on the 1-1 Pittsburgh Steelers here in Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh coming off, or the Huskies coming off of a blowout win against the Atlanta Falcons as Shane and Justin bring down the kick returner at the 20-yard line. Here comes Eric Dillon. QB for the, the Steelers. 386 yards, four touchdowns to two interceptions on the season so far. Solid season for Dillon. He has the Steelers sitting at two, or one and one on the season. Here in week three, China beat the undefeated Huskies. As Sands, the running back, takes it. And he stiff arms one man. Finally brought down by Darrell White. After a 25-yard pickup on first down. Not the way the Huskies defense wanted to start off. But they have been a slower defense to start things off. And now a first and 10 from the 45. Huskies send the blitz. Steelers ran away from a perfect run call. Keys gets about 9.5 on that carry. Makes it a second in inches from the 45. Now it's a second in inches. And the Steelers go right back to the run. And he shoves Shane off of him this time. And Sands picks up five once again. As the Steelers going run heavy this game. They must have saw something in the film that they liked. Now he first and ten from the 40. Dylan under center here. Play action pass. And Gage nearly came away with that one if he turned around. Vigil Hatcher with great pressure up the middle. Now a second and ten from the 40. A bunch to the left for Dylan. Husky send the blitz here. And White and Dylan do a good job at keeping Briggs off the first down line. And it's going to be a third and inches from the 30. As a great throw by Dylan downfield. Down to the three yard line. The Steelers are doing a very nice job this drive so far. Moving down the field with ease. First and goal from the three. And Shane and Grimes get Sands down after a one-yard pickup. Now he's second and goal from the two-yard line. See if the Steelers are going to pass here. They don't. They go with a read option, though. And what is Shane doing on the play? Just was standing there as Dylan walks right by him. Good play call by the Steelers to go with the read option, but bad tackling on the first drive of the game there. Steelers easily drive down the field by running the ball. The Huskies defense has gotten a lot better against the run. As Gage takes this one from the goal line and has a ton of running room and Gage is off to the races and Gage might have his first kick return of the year. And he does into the end zone. Gage blood good. Eighth career kick return touchdown first of this season. There's great blocking on that play. And Gage found the right hole and took it all the way for six. And just like that, the offense won't even see the field. Huskies tie the game. As this one's kicked deep to about the goal line for the Steelers. As McMillan lights up the kick returner, Flynn down at the 18, hit him hard. Now a first and 10 from the 18 yard line. A nice tackle by Vigil Hatcher on that play. Met at the line of scrimmage. Nowhere to go for Sands. Now an empty set here for the Huskies. 
or for the Steelers, I should say. Husky send a blitz, but that's Steven Stanton. They are testing the ball hawk corner, and he's off to the races. Dylan, the only person in front of him, Steven's into the end zone. And the Huskies yet to get on offense, have the lead against the Steelers. 14 to seven. As James Aldridge will kick this one deep. For the third time this quarter. As Steven Stane's X Factor is lit up as McMillan tackles him down at the 25. And Eric Dillon has to be feeling the pressure now with a couple of young quarterbacks behind him on the depth chart. See if he can get it going for the Steelers. First and 10. Go with a play action pass here. And Kitchen with a nice tackle on first down. Three yard pickup for the fullback Goldberg. Second and seven from the 27. As Dylan's beat by the big tight end Hunter. And a gain tackle down at the 29 yard line by three Huskies. Nice throw by Dylan to get it over Dylan. <laughs> and now he first and ten from the twenty-nine. As he's testing him once again, Steven Stan breaks that one up, and Steven Stan is looking like a true number one corner on that left side. Second and ten from the twenty-nine yard line. Dylan under center, a play action pass here. Going across the middle of the field, left a wide open. CJ tackles him down at the six. Fortunately, right now, the Huskies can't seem to do multiple good things at once. As a couple good things and then they struggle. Now a first and goal from the six for the Steelers. Huskies send a blitz and Shane with really nice coverage on the line or the running back nearly Jumped in, picked that one off. Keys with a two-yard catch on the play. Second and goal from the five. They go with a toss to the right. As Gage is there with a great open field tackle on Sands. Second tackle of the game for Gage. And that one loses a couple for the Steelers here on third and goal from the seven. Two tight ends on the field for the Steelers. As Vigil Hatcher is closing in and CJ as well. Both get away and Vigil hits Dylan as he throws it away. Steelers are going to have to settle for three here. At the end of the first quarter, the Huskies yet to get on offense. But with a 14-7 lead. As CJ and Vigil Hatcher have to come away with a sack on that play right there. But Steelers do kick a field goal. Making the score 14 to 10 right now. As now the Huskies might get on offense for the first time, and they will as this one's booted deep in the end zone. That's where Josh and the offense will come out. Had one of his best games ever last week. It's 440. 55 yards, four touchdowns, two interceptions on the season. Jason Blacklock, after coming off of his best career game, looking to do more this week. Now a first and 10 from the 25. Josh hits Hunter underneath. Hunter able to get about nine and a half. Makes it second and inches for the first play for the Huskies. Second and inches from the 35 yard line. Two tight ends on the field. As Drew Stevens able to pick up the first down. Picks up two on that carry. Gets down to the 37 before being tackled. First and 10 now. Trips to the left for Josh. As Josh had Damian deep, but the blitz got to him. Not able to put enough on the ball. 
As I say, second and 10 now from the 37. Josh under center with two tight ends on the field. The drop back pass here. As Josh hits Hunter once again, and Hunter has tons of room to run down to the 40-yard line. Two catches for 33 yards for Hunter in this one. First and 10 from the 40 now. Empty set here for Josh. As that one goes to Connor Kelly, who's wide open and is into the end zone. Miscommunication by the Steelers secondary, and the Huskies take advantage of it. Josh found them right away into the end zone for a Huskies touchdown. And in five plays, the Huskies bring their lead back to two scores. And James Aldridge will kick this one deep. To about the goal line. It's Franklin and Rosenberg bring him down at the 20. That's where Eric Dillon and this Steelers offense will look to begin. First and 10 from the 20. As they Sands shugs him shugs an arm tackle off of him. Able to get down to the 40-yard line after a 20-yard pickup. Now he first and 10 from the 40. A counter play. Four Saiyans who picks up seven on that one after breaking the first tackle once again. In past weeks, these Huskies were pretty good at tackling. And now, starting to struggle a little bit. Second and three from the 47. As Young out of position on that one. And Dylan finds the open man downfield. Gets him down to the 25 yard line, nearing the red zone once again. First and 10. Steelers are going to go with a pass here. And they're going to test Steven Stan once again. And he nearly makes him pay for the second time. QBs are going to have to learn to stop testing Steven Stan. So far this season, second and 10 from the 25, a bunch to the right. As that one hits off the back of Hunter, who never expected the ball to come his way. It is now a third and 10 from the 25 yard line for the Steelers. Trying to get into the end zone here. And a great play. Designed for Jeff Hunter to get wide open on it. Stevenson jumped up on the underneath. Javon Young just wasn't quick enough to get into zone fast enough. As Hunter was left wide open in the end zone. Some blown coverages and poor tackling so far in this one has kept the Steelers in it. As a high scoring first half. As I say, first and 10 from the 25 for the Huskies. Only their second offensive drive of the game. As that one goes to Jason Blacklock, hangs onto that one. Picks up four on it. An injured Steelers defensive lineman goes out straight to the locker room, holding his forearm. Now he's second and six from the 29. It's a handoff to Drew Stevens. Breaks the first tackle and is still going down to about the 38-yard line. First and 10 from the 38. First time seeing Steven Sutherland in the backfield this game. The play action pass here. And Josh going to have to get, get it to Kylo quickly who ends up dropping it. A bad drop by Kylo after a very good route, and he had tons of room to run. Now he's second and 10 from the 38. Josh and Gun here. As he gets that one off to Damien as he was getting hit, picks up the first down and more down to the 50. That steal his defender. The defender was mean mugging Damien over there. First and 10 from the 50 now. Josh under center with a bunch. The counter play to Steven Sutherland and Damian misses that key block there. Steven had a ton of running room if he hits it. 
Now, two minute warning here. Huskies up four, driving on the Steelers once again here. Looking to score right before half. A second and eight from the 49. Huskies go with a screen to Drew Stevens, have plenty of blockers in front, and Stevens is off to the races. Stevens has one man to beat, stiff arming his way down to the four. A great play call against the Blitz. And the Steelers were not ready for that one, down to the five. A bunch to the right for Josh here. And that one's picked off, thrown in tight coverage. Josh tried to fit it in between the defender. And a great pick by the Steelers DB. Coming away with it. Thought Peterson had a chance to catch it, but wasn't able to. And now the Steelers have the ball. And a great route by Jeff Hunter, the tight end, beating Darrell White. Now a first and 10 from the 28. As Javon Young with a good open field tackle. Now the Steelers with all the momentum right now after the turnover. Driving down the field with ease. First and 10 from the 32. And Dylan with a nice breakup on that one. Nearly jumped it. As the DBs look to be playing a little bit conservative right now. Not jumping everything in front of them. Could be costing them, but they first or second and 10 from the 32 after the drop. And once again, gauging nice coverage, but doesn't turn his head quick enough. And Jeff Hunter able to get his feet in. Now has his X Factor. First and 10 from the 21. Huskies send a blitz here. And an overthrow on good coverage by Young. On the out route. Will be a second and 10 from the 21 once again. Steelers looking to pass. They go with a check down here. It's a good tackle from Justin Martinez. Third and five from the 16. Can the Huskies get the Steelers off the field here? And they can't a first down for the Steelers. Down to the five. First and goal from the five. And Dylan with perfect coverage on the receiver. Picks it off and Dylan is off to the races. One of our fastest DBs. And I don't think anybody's going to catch him. And Dylan's going to get the second pick six of the game. What a play by Dylan Flock. Believe it's his fourth career pick six. And this one was about a 105 yard pick six. Giving the Huskies a 28 to 17 lead just when you thought the Steelers were about to take the lead. And the Huskies have two offensive possessions. And are winning this game. Offensively, they're going to have to get in a rhythm with short possessions. And defensively, they're going to have to stop the middle of the field passing attack. And most importantly, get after Eric Dillon. When you rattle Eric Dillon, he doesn't play that well. And we have yet to do that this game. But a first and 10 from the 25. Steelers already over 315 total yards of offense. A handoff to Drew St Stevens picks up nine on a nice carry. Three carries for 20 yards for Drew. Second and one from the 34. Bunch to the right for Josh Sutherland in the backfield. A play action pass here. Josh gets it off to Hunter. A nice pass down to the 49 yard line. Third catch of the game for Hunter. 448 yards. They trap play for Drew Stevens. Nobody's in front. Trucks his way through one defender down to the 38. First and 10 from the 38-yard line. Now Josh and Gunn here. 
Drew Stevens still in the backfield. And Josh just kind of throws that one into the dirt before getting hit. It'll be a second and 10 from the 38. Play action pass here. And Connor Kelly wide open and gets drilled across the middle of the field. But Josh put that ball in a nice position to get away from the safety. But the safety makes a great play on it and drills Connor Kelly. Now he's third and 10 from the 38. Empty set here for the Huskies. And Josh hits Hunter right behind the safety. Gets him down to the 14-yard line. First and 10 from the 14 now. Josh on their center once again. It's a handoff to Drew Stevens. Picks up three on that one. Second and seven from the 11-yard line now. Trips to the left for Josh. And Damian Harrison into the end zone for a Huskies touchdown. And right now it is too easy on offense. Get into the red zone on all three offensive drives. One was a pick. But that's their second offensive touchdown of the game. They were up 35-17. Unless a complete collapse by this Huskies team. They're looking at 3-0 right now. It's a nice tackle by Rosenberg after Connor slows him up. Sands had a nice game. 7 rushes, 56 yards. A couple of catches as well for Sands. As the defense is going to have to play better. But does have 2 turnovers which is huge. A good tackle by Gage pushes Sands out after a four-yard pickup. A second and six from the 26. Dylan drops back the pass and Justin Martinez with a nice play on that one to break that up. Makes it a third and six. Third and six. From the 26 for the Steelers. Huskies defense looking to get them off the field. CJ Hunter coming in. And an overthrown by Eric Dillon. Have to wonder if CJ didn't force that pressure from the inside. If that wasn't if that was gonna be a completion. But a punt from the Steelers will give the Huskies back the ball. As a good punt back to about the 18. Connor will return it. Bring it up to the 29. Solid return. Here comes Josh in the offense. Once again. First and 10 from the 29. An empty set here with 343 left in the first. Or in the third, I should say. Josh is his. He tried to throw that one. Second and 10 from the 29. Josh is going to hand the ball off to Steven Sutherland. Sutherland picks up nine on that one. Sutherland kind of gives you a different burst of speed that Drew Stevens doesn't. But a third and one from the 38-yard line. Stevens in the backfield now. It's a handoff to Drew. And Drew isn't able to pick up the first down, but the offense is going to stay on the field here. They hurried up to the line. Trying to catch the Steelers off guard. They go for it. And Drew Stevens gets that one. A ballsy call by Coach Paul. But it pays off for the Huskies. It's now a first and 10 from the 41. Bunch to the right for Josh. Peterson's going to hang on to that one. Pick up five. The offense is in a nice rhythm right now. Second and five from the 47. It's a play action pass. And he hits Hunter underneath. Hunter fights for more. Picks up about seven on that second and five. And the first down. It's his fifth catch of the game. 
First and 10 from the 47 now. Trips to the left. Stevens in the backfield. The read option and Josh takes this one. There's a flag on the play though and Josh picks up about eight. Check out the penalty. There is going to be a hold. Who is it on? Daniel Fernandez. Big contract gear for Daniel. And have to see a lot of improvement from him. If he wants that second contract. But now a first and 10 from the 43. Empty set here for the Huskies. Hunter hangs on to that one as safety played that nice. Didn't give Josh to over the top. And played Hunter nicely underneath. And now it's a second and 15 from the 48. Hussey's coming back out in an empty set. And Josh right back to Hunter. But Hunter can't hang on to that one as they hit, hit hard from behind. Incompletion on that. And now it's a third and 15. Third and 15 from the 48. Sutherland and Jamal Lacey in the game for this play. As Josh is looking downfield, hits Kylo. Under threw him. If he threw him in stride, that was a touchdown. But a great ball from Josh getting hit. He threw it. Puts it on the money. And gets the Huskies into the red zone once again. A first and 10 from the 12. A 40-yard catch for Kylo. It's a handoff to Drew Stevens. Picks up three on that carry. And that will end the third quarter here. As the Huskies are dominating once again. Looking to tack on another seven points. And Josh under center. As he hits Damian Harrison, who walks into the end zone. And it is all Huskies this second half. A dominating performance in back-to-back -back weeks. Was close in the first half until the Dylan pick six. And ever since that, it's been all Huskies. Scoring 21 unanswered points. Let's see if the Steelers have anything left in them late in this game as Connor just saved his kick return touchdown as Shane comes from behind to tackle him as Eric Dillon coming back out on the field for the Steelers first and 10 from the 36 as Gage and Dillon make a nice tackle of a gain of 4 Empty set here for the Steelers. As Eric Dillon's going to run it. And CJ Hunter blows it up in the backfield. For a loss of about three. It's going to be a third and nine. Third and nine from the 39. Huskies send the blitz here. Javon Young, really nice coverage downfield. Tips it into the air. Incomplete. Had perfect man coverage on Hunter. And the Steelers are going to go for it. Risky call here for the Steelers. But down so many points. Have to do whatever it takes. As good coverage by Steven saying Only one place where Eric Dillon could put that ball. And it's into the crowd. Now a first and 10 from the 39 for the Huskies. Looking to just run out some of this clock here. Up big already and a nice tackle on Drew Stevens right there. Picks up four. Now he's second and six from the 35. All three tight ends on the field here for Josh. It's a handoff to Drew Stevens. And Stevens trucks his way through one but doesn't pick up the first down. A third and one from the 30 now. Josh under center here. About 420 left in this one. Play action pass. As Josh overthrows Jason downfield on that one. The 
Huskies are going to leave the offense out on the field here. Fourth and one from the 30. And Josh hits Hunter on the bubble screen to pick that first down up. Another catch for Hunter, adding to his total from his good performance so far this game. Seven catches, 85 yards. First and 10 from the 27. The handoff to Drew Stevens. Stevens trucks his way through one, hits hard at the 22. Picks up five, though, on that carry. Second and five from the 22 now. Haskins is in the backfield. It's a handoff to Haskins, who only gets back to the line of scrimmage. Couldn't use that speed to get to the edge. Now the Huskies are looking to end this game with a first down here with 2.30 left. Going an empty set. As Josh, confused by the coverage, threw it right at the DB. Damian luckily jumps it nearly hangs on to it but a good play by the DB to force that ball out and the Huskies have to settle for three here and go up 45 to 17 as J James Aldridge will kick this one deep for the Steelers with 220 left in this one Rosenberg with a nice trip up on that play. Then Kirkpatrick finishes the tackle. Here comes Eric Dillon. And an empty set now. Steelers looking to at least score another time before this game's over. And Gage nearly jumps that one. A couple of broken tackles by the Steelers playmaker right there. Keys, the running back. Third catch of the game, four keys. Gage has been on a couple of those underneath routes. So far, this game nearly jumped that one. With a first and 10 from the 31. Husky sitting in man once again. And another play with great coverage by Gage. Just somehow he's not getting his head around to pick these balls off. But he's in near perfect position every time. First and 10 from the 50 now for the Steelers. A minute 30 left. And that time a really nice throw by Dylan over a couple of Huskies defenders. Gets them down to the 29. First and 10 from the 29. See what the Steelers do here. They go underneath and Justin Martinez there for the tackle. Only picks up four on that play. As the Steelers just taking their time here. Not rushing. Down a lot. As Darrell White nearly had his pick there. But tackled at the four by Javon Young. See if the Steelers are even going to attempt a last play. As it looks like they will. Final play of the game. And a drop touchdown by tight end Jeff Hunter. And the Huskies are going to hang on to this one. 45-17. Dominating performance by both sides of the ball here. As Josh had a 119.8. QB rating 15 of 24, 250 yards, three touchdowns. Did have that one red zone pick. Rushing attack solid once again. Drew Stevens led the team with 56 carry or 56 yards on 11 carries. Hunter led the team in catches with two or seven for 85 yards. Damian Harrison with two touchdowns. Connor Kelly with a 40 yard touchdown and a couple of explosive plays for a couple of these guys who don't get a ton of touches. Jason Blacklock was held in check after his really good performance. Gage and Shane led the team in tackles there. Tackle for loss for Gage and CJ. A pick from Steven Sand and Dylan, both going back for six, and a deflection from Steven Sand. No forced fumbles, but a dominating performance here in week three in Pittsburgh. And the Huskies hang on to 
their win and go with a 3-0 and while the Steelers fall to 1-2. And, and I'll see y'all in week four. Peace.